I love meats. I've had it my entire life. The wet, the juicy sensation within my mouth. Insane. However, I'm gonna become vegan for the next seven days. Colonel, I'll see you in a week. The rules are simple. Any animal related products I cannot eat. And by the end of our journey, my vegan knowledge shall be tested by a meat lover eating my vegan food. Starting off day one, I didn't know what to eat. So I'm gonna go eat with my friend Allie. She's very cool, but she's vegan, I think. All right, so I'm in. Oh, hey, Allie, what's up? Are you? <laughs> what, the fuck? What, are you what are you doing? Breakfast. So Remember when I said she was actually vegan? She is really vegan. Yeah. <laughs> Let me show you what vegan eat. We're here. This is the vegan restaurant. I don't know why Manuel's here. He absolutely loves meat. I just gobble on that meat. I ordered the vegan chicken sandwich as my first vegan meal, which was pretty good. But then I realized, dude, I love meat. I think I'm already like missing it since I do eat eggs in you the morning. Are, you're showing this in a vegan restaurant. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Eating at the end of seven. So you're missing meat already, bro? It's a <laughs> <laughs> you know what you might get? Cravings. All you're gonna be thinking about is finger licking good advert that KFC play every single day. She was right. KFC was going to haunt me for the next seven days, so I drank a protein shake to calm the monster down. And day two commenced. What's up, guys? It's 8 a.m. I'm gonna go shoot a video with my friend Manuel. I feel pretty great. I feel pretty solid. Protein shake definitely helped me out, and I'm drinking water as of right now. Turns out being an influencer referee requires a lot of energy, so with Ellie's recommendations, I went grocery shopping and picked up my arsenal of vegan. Food. It's really hot outside, so I changed shirts. Orange chicken, fries, veggie burgers, frozen strawberries with almond milk. I think the almond milk really complements the strawberry. Then veggie burgers, and then fries, and then this. All set. So, so far, the chicken is not bad. The veggie burgers are pretty good, in my opinion. I was actually enjoying being vegan. However, thanks took a huge turn with my spontaneous two-day trip to New York City. And my diet consisted of mainly Chipotle and Prime. And it was interesting to hear what New Yorkers think about vegans. My son is a vegetarian. I'm a carnivore. I eat meat. My son is stupid. He don't eat meat. He's a vegan dude. I like to die. Fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> Hearing the guy talking about meat made me realize I was starving. Okay, it's currently 10.30. Currently editing a video. I want to eat meat so bad. I think I have to go to sleep actually because I don't think I could be able to hold this, this in. This is my fourth day and this is my first meat carving or starving. At this point, I didn't know if I could hold in my hunger for fresh KFC while being vegan. I'm at Burger King right now. If you guys don't know, they got the Impossible Whopper. 100% made of plants, 0% made of beef. Alright, take it out. Alright, right, he told me it was really good. I'm, I'm excited now. Oh my god. I'm gonna eat you up. This is actually pretty good. Burger King, you slap, bro. This, this is so good. I'm not even kidding. Wow. Actually pretty good. Now I needed to convince people that being vegan is tasty and cool. So I went to a comedy club where there would be a crowd. Real question though, how do you guys feel about vegan? Vegans are bro. Oh, bro. Oh, yeah. Vegans are I feel attacked, low key. I actually feel attacked. You're the only vegan I like. Oh, thanks, man. I love you. Yeah. It's okay. Everyone thinks that vegan food is nasty, but I'm here to prove that vegan food can be as delicious as animal-based meals. Everyone is doubting me right now. Like, everyone thinks that vegan food is just terrible and nasty. And you can't even eat it. The meat lover that's gonna eat my vegan food literally just texted me saying that he's not even sure if he wants to because he thinks that the food is gonna be gross. I literally had to text him reaffirming that it's not gonna be bad because I'm gonna make sure it's gonna be good. I'm truly gonna make this work. I know vegan food is not nasty. Damn, why does everyone think it's nasty? But first, I have to convince my own roommates with the impossible nuggets. I, really? Yeah, I'll eat it. Okay, okay. Oh, I didn't think you would. Okay, sure. No, I'm, I was gonna <laughs> <make> so. <laughs> Okay. Taste, this one actually tastes like chicken. <laughs> Man, dude, that makes me so happy. This is all completely naturally not animal based. And tomorrow, it's another day, a better day. You're right, Mr. Manny, it is. So the next morning, I worked out and I decided to spice things up by eating a quesadilla with almond cheese. It tastes the exact same. Damn it. Ouch. That was good. Like, I'm surprised. I just replaced the animal-based products with an alternative that's not animal-based, and it tasted the exact same. As day six went by, the literal unexpected happened. Oh, oh, guys. I am, dude, I'm officially an influencer. You know why? <laughs> I influenced Michael to get the Impossible Chicken Nuggets. That honestly is a huge win for the video. I actually influenced someone, so you could call me an influencer, Mr. Man. That makes me so happy, guys. Like, actually, I influenced someone. All right, Michael, what do you think of my video? 
vegan experience. What do you honestly think though, like for real? I'm surprised you did it, especially with the New York thing. That was honestly the hardest task in New York City to be vegan. I thought you were gonna give up. I did want to give up, but I had a reason to keep pushing. I had to prove that being vegan can be as fun and tasty just like juicy meat. And that's why you should subscribe. So the next and final day, I went to the store and bought the ingredients for the spaghetti and vegan meatballs for the certified meat lover. I was ready and used the vegan alternatives to make the meatballs and everything was going perfect. I even cooked an additional vegetable appetizer since I was feeling extra confident. These aren't looking too bad. For my first time, they look pretty good. Look at this, meatballs. All right, vegan balls. All right, so I was taking a poo poo and uh, <clears throat> something happened. Yes, <laughs> could be worse. I am cooking more though. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, okay. The food was ready. These seven days have led up to this exact moment. Oh, couple, Smells couple good. More seconds. Oh, yeah? He has no idea what he's about to witness. First in history, I got my homie meals. They're vegan, but he's a meat lover. Right, Ollie? You're, 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 you're you love meat? Lover. I love meat. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, my eyes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Whoa, this... Oh, yep. I'm fucking with this one. This one looks sick. Dig in. Dig in. Dig in. It's actually... <laughs> Dude, this is gas. Really? No. Oh my god. I would, eat this. I would go to a restaurant and get this. Wait, okay, are you are you lying or no? No, I'm not. Oh shit. Okay. The cow even even look the cow wants it. Look how much you want to eat. I don't know what it is. It's fire. It's really not that hard to become vegan. If you guys want, it's easy, even though I'm not gonna become vegan fully because I just love meat so much. You love meat, I can confirm. I've given this kid the meat so many times. Yeah, he's right. I love meat, but I think I'm gonna stay vegan for a while. Hi, welcome to KC, what can I get started for you? Hey, um, can I get 